Okay, so question 10 asks, what is the difference between an ether and an ester? So an ether is when you have an oxygen that is in the middle of two different organic groups. So these can be any carbon groups. So that's what the R stands for. So a way to remember it is that there is a carbon on either side. So these are ethers. So esters are similar to ethers, except it's kind of like the carboxylic derivative. So it is also in the middle of two uh, carbon groups, except it has um, a double bonded O and another O. Yep, so this is what I mean by carboxylic derivative is that it is the same as like a carboxylic acid, except except for it being at the end, like instead of it being OH, it's in the middle, so it has another carbon group attached to it on the right side. Okay, so this is just a breakdown of ether versus ester. So the junior tutor said, although they sound similar, the two classes of organic compounds are different. You can see this by looking at their structure. Ether is an organic derivative of water that has two organic residues, R and R prime, singly bonded to the same oxygen atom. Ester, on the other hand, is a carboxylic acid derivative where the carbonyl group is bonded to another organic residue and an epoxy group. Yep, the solution is correct.